It's time to start lesson eight. Click on start quiz. And just as before, the answers are not graded. So please click any random answer. And click show results. Continue. And make sure you click activate all. There are only four chapters in lesson eight. We will start with chapter one using captions. Click Learn and click Continue. With Tolano Employee Handbook open, move to the bottom half of page two and then click on the Tolano Environmental Consulting picture. So here's page one. We'll move down here to page two and there are two uh, pictures. So let's make sure we click on the correct one that says Tolano Environmental Consulting. There we are. In the References tab, please find the button for Insert Caption. If necessary, in the Label field, make sure that Figure is selected. And in the Caption Name, we're going to type a hyphen, TEC, all caps, Division, TEC Division, and then we're going to click the Numbering button. With the drop down for Format, we're going to select the capital A, capital B, capital C option and click OK. And then for position, we're going to click on the drop down arrow and choose above selected item. And then we're going to click OK. There is our caption. Even though it may seem repetitious to enter the same information as shown in the picture, remember that you can set up a list of all items that have been captioned in a document. So this is beneficial when someone wants to quickly locate a particular item. Notice also that the text box for the caption causes the text from the previous paragraph to wrap around the text box. You can choose to add more space between the text and the images or resize the text box. With the caption box selected, I'm going to click on the, one of the edges, resize the height to be half its original size. Click away, away from the text box to view the text, caption, and the text. So let's click and drag the bottom middle handle to make it half the size, or we could use the top too. At this point, you can decide if you want more space between the paragraph and the caption, but, but we will leave it, as, uh, leave it as is. Select the other picture, the Tolano Adventures picture, and on the Reference tab, choose Insert Caption again. For the caption title, we're going to put a hyphen, capital T-A, Division and click OK. Also resize the caption box to half its original height. There we go. Go to the page with the smart art diagram and then the instruction panel gives you a little picture of it and then select it. Scroll down quite a bit. Here is the smart art graphic. We're going to insert a caption and we're going to type to, uh, hyphen Tolano organization chart and click OK. Mark as answered and click Next. Go to the bottom of the next page and select the entire table. So this table is uh, right underneath vacation day. So I'm going to use the table select button and I'm going to insert a caption and I'm going to change the label from figure to table and I'm going to change the numbering button and switch it make sure it's back on one two three and click OK and we're going to title this table hyphen vacation days and click OK. Using steps one and two we're going to add captions for the two tables on page nine so I'm going to scroll down here's a table I'm going to use the table selector tool go to insert captions and I'm going to call this one dental coverage and leave it as a table a label and then click OK and then click the next table and go to insert caption and call this one long term disability plan and click OK mark as answer and click next Go to the end of the document, I'm going to press Control N to get to the end, and now press Control Enter to create a new page. Type list of figures and tables. 
and press enter. Then apply heading two to our title. So I'm going to select our title that we just typed, go to the home tab and choose heading two. Mark as answer and click next. Click in the blank line below our new title that starts with list and click on the references tab. In the captions group, we're going to click insert table of figures. In the caption label box here towards the bottom, we are going to change that to figure and click OK. It then lists all of the figures that were referenced in our document. Press enter and now we're going to go back to the insert table of figures and this time we'll make sure it says table, which it does, and click OK. Now this references all the tables that we captioned in the report. Mark is answered and click show results. Click yes. Great, you have now completed Lesson 8, Chapter 1.